Researchers were ecstatic when, in 2018, landscapers unearthed the skeletal remains of a horse in a backyard in Lehigh, Utah. At the time, scientists thought the horse dated to the last ice age because the bones were buried in sediment dating to about 16,000 years ago. But now, a new study shows they were way off, by a lot. It turns out this horse didn't live in the last ice age. Instead, radiocarbon dating shows its bones are no older than 340 years old. The team found that the horse lived sometime after 1680, but likely before Europeans permanently settled in the Great Salt Lake area in the mid-1800s. Despite this epic mistake, it's still an exciting find, the researcher said. An analysis of the horse's anatomy and DNA indicate that it was a domesticated horse likely raised, ridden, and cared for by the indigenous people. Horses have a long history in North America. They lived here from about 50 million to 10,000 years ago, disappearing about the same time as other large animals, including mammoths, short-faced bears, and giant sloths that went extinct at the end of the last ice age. It's likely that these big animals went extinct as they dealt with a combination of climate change and human interactions. However, horses were reintroduced to the Americas in the 16th century when the Spaniards brought them over. Many indigenous people who lived in the Americas swiftly integrated horses into their cultures and economies. And that's how this horse fits into the picture. A genetic analysis showed that it was a domesticated horse, scientifically known as Equus caballus, that was raised by indigenous people in what is now Utah, possibly by the Utes or Shoshone cultures. The Lehigh horse shows that, that there is an incredible archeological record out there of the early relationship between indigenous people and horses, a record that tells us things not written in any European histories, said study lead author William Taylor a curator of archaeology at the University of Colorado Museum of Natural History. An analysis of this horse's bones showed that it was a female and about 12 years old when it died, meaning it was an older mare. The horse's spine had fractures indicative of horseback riding, meaning someone likely rode this horse bareback or with a soft saddle pad and banged up and down on the horse's back while riding. The horse also had a number of maladies, including arthritis. So why keep around an old horse? The researcher said that it's possible that indigenous people cared for this mare because they wanted to breed her with stallions in the herd. <laughs>